Hey friends, in the previous video, we had seen how we can add multiple users in Active Directory group using a PowerShell script. Now in this video, we will see how we can remove multiple users from Active Directory group using a PowerShell script. So let's start. I'm just going to open the PowerShell script inside the PowerShell uh, ISC tool. Now I will go on the file and then uh, this is the name of the PowerShell script that I just created. So in the very first line I am just specifying a variable name that is dollar group and in this dollar group I am uh, mentioning the group name from which we just want to remove the members. So you need to just replace the group name uh, whatever that you have specified in your Active Directory group and you want to remove the members so you have to specify the group name and in the second variable that is dollar $users in this dollar $users I am just using a PowerShell command that is import dash CSV and dash path so this is the path where I just specified a CSV file and in this CSV file all the users which are the members of this group is specified so you have to just follow the steps how for creating the CSV file so like uh, username and then in the first column you need to specify username and then all the names of the users like vikash.gupta which is the member of this IT team RW you can just verify by just clicking on the group or you can also check the username and membership now members if you see this is the vikas.gupta i just specified added this users in this uh, uh, it team r rw group so this is the name of this user similarly if you go through the vikas.gupta and avinav and uh, test.user so these three users are the member of this group now we just want to remove these three so what I need to do I need to just specify these all users in the CSV file next for each loop so this is the for each loop and in this for each loop I am using a new variable that is dollar $user and then dollar $user so so the values of the users variable will also comes inside the dollar user here now a new variable that is username and inside the username I am just calling the username which is mentioned inside the CSV file now another new variable that is dollar user object in this dollar user object I am just fetching the user details by using active directory command that is get dash ad user this is the active directory powershell command and this will fetch the details of the user now if user object if user object exists in my active directory and member of the group so this will just use a command that is remove ad group member so this is a powershell command for removing the users from any group now identity so group name this is the group name IT team RW members if users is the member of the of the IT team RW so this will just remove and this will prompt a message user username vikas.gupta and other users similarly so removed from group and the group name else if user does not exist or not the part of this group so this will prompt a message user username not found now I'm just going to execute this PowerShell script. So let's see. User Vikash.gupta removed from group name that is IT team RW. This is what here it is mentioned like uh, username. This will remove and this will prompt a message user username uh, removed from the group name which is mentioned inside the group variable. So this is the method which you can follow to uh, remove the users and you can also cross check if the users have been removed from the, uh, from the groups which you have just mentioned. So I'm going to click on the groups and we'll click on the IT team RW. 
just refresh this again close this and uh, let's see so this all user all three users have been removed from this uh, IT team RW groups. So this is the methods which you need to just follow to removing this group membership. You can also see this PowerShell script on my web blog website that is infoelias.com. Here you can just scroll it and just I created a blog that is bulk AD group membership removal. And here you can see this is the same PowerShell script which I just mentioned which we just explained on this uh, lab and uh, you can follow it and you can just um, make the changes accordingly if you just want to remove the groups group membership from your active directory thank you for watching this video